Today is the day. We are picking up somebody that we met playing video games from the airport. It's kind of strange. Let me give you some context real quick. So about six years ago, five years ago, four years ago. Let's go with four years ago. We met this, and by we, I'm talking my good buddies, Joe, Steven, Jake, Cody, those guys. We met this squeaker kid that was just absolutely annoying. But he hung around and he actually proved himself to be a pretty cool kid. He is now turning 19 and we are picking him up from the airport. This weekend we're taking him to Vancouver in Canada so he can get a little, uh, a little drink in him. So it should be a good time. You know, people give video games and a hard, such a hard time when the reality of it is you're actually creating friendships and it's kind of strange to think about it that way, but it's the truth. I mean, you end up meeting somebody that's, I don't know, either annoying, ends up coming around all the time in this case, and you just, you end up meshing. Well, this kid ended up getting a job now he's flying himself from New York City, not New York City, but Buffalo, all the way to Washington to come hang out with us. How cool is that? A lot of people that have told this are like, dude, you're a wacko. That is, uh, that's kind of, that's a little sketchy, dude. I'm like, I, yeah, I guess, but we, we know this person. But yeah, back on the video game thing. It's cool that it creates friendships, even though you're far away in a far distance. What people don't know about is the technology with video games and being able to chat with people in chat rooms. It's like a open Skype in a way, but you're talking every single day. So you technically end up knowing this person really well for the most part. And that is what happened with Tyler. So right now I'm currently waiting for Joe and Steven to pick me up and we're gonna go surprise him or go pick him up at the airport and surprise him with some, uh, some creepy signs that I made. If we get the chance, we're kind of running late a little bit, but I will see you guys in Steven car when he comes face me let's do it pick up Tyler from the airport Joe. and good old Steve. Joe, do you think it's weird that we're picking up Tyler that's a 19 year old that we played video games with uh, four years ago? Someone from... said 19 year olds and I was in. <laughs> <laughs> what about you Steve? Do you find it a little weird? Nah, it's awful. Every time I say it they think it's weird. I, mean, I don't know. He's gonna be staying in my house so if anybody dies it's gonna be me. <laughs> that's true. Do you not know this guy's not gonna steal all your shit? I don't, I don't think he's gonna steal our shit. Maybe but he will but I don't have that much. So. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be fun picking him up and having a good time. We're gonna go to uh, Vancouver and check it out. By check it out, I mean drink like a fish. Because it's legal to get minors drunk <laughs> in Canada. In Canada. <laughs> <laughs> Might be a raper, we don't really know. We're just kind of going for it, hoping for the best here. Out here. What's oh, up, dude? The whole fing gang! The bitch was and everything. What's up, dude? Oh my god! What's up, man? Freaking in, folks! Oh my god! You see the side, oh, we're adopting god, you, bro. Dude. Yeah, we're Our adopting side. you. Glad the surgery went well. Welcome home, Tyler. <laughs> so, dude. I was getting my haircut yesterday <laughs> and my mom's friend was like, aren't you worried they're gonna kill you? <laughs> so you ready to have some dicks? Oh dude, you're eating a whole bag of all dicks. All three of them? Yeah, all, all three. three of them. You're eating a whole bag of dicks today. Dick. Uh, uh, Four cheeseburgers. Uh, is this cash only here? It's a fucking shit right now. <laughs> <laughs> They've been cash only forever. He's from New York. We just picked him up. It's his first time out here. So. Yeah. Welcome to Seattle. Yeah. He was a little weirded out when they told him we're going to make him eat a bag of Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. From Seattle. Thank you. Thank you, Steven. I had a drone if I knew you were going to die. Hell yeah. <laughs> Are 
I want to see this happen. No, <laughs> you're not in the video of me punching a pigeon on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, listen, we're going to toss these in the garbage. You got the tailgate there, bud? Good boy. <laughs> Should we like mob to your house and then... It's up to you. What do you want to do? I guess we can just go straight to my house if you want to come over again. That's what we'll do. Yeah. Alright. Then the German Shepherds don't eat it the first night. <laughs> yeah. Don't yeah, dog. Dude, that's my bag, dog. Alright, dudes. Hi. Alright. Alright. So we're back at the house after the fact of when he's been here. I just wanted to make like a few episodes with Tyler visiting. I don't want to make them too long because it's kind of hard to sit through long videos sometimes for uh, people, but I decided to make them short and sweet and kind of just cover the weekend that he was here visiting. I know it's super random for the channel. The channel is super random in itself. So <laughs> hopefully you guys like the next, I think I might do three episodes out of this. We'll see. Just this one and another one or this one, another one and another one, three total or something like that. And comment down below what you guys think about like meeting people online and video games or whatever. Let's have a conversation about it. I think it's kind of cool that he did it. Some people will think it's weird, but whatever. So if you guys liked the video, please slap that thumbs up button and subscribe. And I'll love you guys forever. See you on the next episode. Tell you, tell you, tell you, tell you.